what's up YouTube I'm back again with another video this time it's gonna be the top 10 Dollar Tree cents that uh, I think is worthy of men checking out or whatever uh, just put them all in the top 10 here and um, that's an overall good sense you know in my opinion uh, they all got great longevity great projection and uh for a dollar at a Dollar Tree, man, you can't go wrong with this sense. These are some cheap cents, but it's some good sense. <laughs> All right. <laughs> okay, it started off. We're going to go with Blue Mist right here. It's what it look like. Good Dollar Tree scent. Can be had it for a dollar at the Dollar Tree. Uh, good spread. Good longevity spread. Great projection. All of them got the same spread, so I won't have to spray them all. Once again, it's Blue Mist. And this right here is a knockoff version of Cool Water. My opinion, just as strong. Uh, great longevity. Like I said, great projection. And uh, these are made by European American designers. Uh, you cannot go wrong with these scents only for a dollar. Shoot. I highly recommend y'all get out there. Y'all on a budget or something like that. And those of you who don't like spending a whole lot of money in colognes, just want something to throw on and, you know, it's fresh enough, smell good on the go or whatever. Grab you this once again. This blue mist. Moving on to the next is this here is EC. EC. I just say EC, and this is made by the same folks, American, European, American designers. And uh, these are some good, this is a good scent, good longevity, good projection. It's called, but it's an EC, I N U, something like that. But anyway, this here, what it smells like, uh, this is basically just a good spray, uh, knockoff version of. CK1, good scent. Like I said, good projection, good longevity. For only a dollar, can I go wrong with these? With any of these scents, y'all can go grab all these at one time. You know, these are my top 10. You know, y'all can grab all these in one day, 10 bucks. You know, I'm going to bring y'all some stuff that, you know, it ain't going to cost you a whole lot of money. You still smell good. And these scents are really strong. You no. Know, like I said, a great projection, great longevity, and uh, as you can see, I have used them, you know. I have used them a lot in the past. You know, I, I wear them now, you know. Yeah, you know, especially I don't want nothing too heavy, you know, like, you know, most I wear the oils, but I wear these, you know, I just want something light, you know, like this, you know, throw them. Good projection, good longevity. Once again, it's E C I U N. It's a knockoff version of C K one. Those of you like C K one, I highly recommend this right here though. Because it smells just like Ralph Lauren. I think it's Ralph Lauren C K one. I guess. Okay. Moving on to the next. I told y'all about this before. And this right here is this is Jacob's Jaco. What is Jacob's Red. This here is a knockoff version of Polo Red. Now this smells so good. As you can see, I used it. It smells so good, you know. I couldn't resist using it. <laughs> so I, I highly recommend y'all get out there and get this. Uh, I'm bringing it back up because this here is what I recommend in my top 10. My top 10 Dollar Tree cents. I highly, I highly recommend y'all get out there and get this right here. Once again, it's, it's Jacos, Jacos Red. And it's, like I said, it's a knockoff version of Polo Red. Get out there, scoop it up, because the girl's going to love it. Trust me. <laughs> hey. All right. <laughs> That's what it look like. Once again, close up. Knockoff version of Polo Red. Jacob's Red. 
Matter of fact, I bought two of these when I smelled it in the store. This smelled so good, I said, shit. I'll grab me another bottle of this. And I got two around here somewhere. All right, moving on to the next. It's what I got. It's engraved. This here is, uh, I don't know what this is supposed to be. What replica, what knockoff version of this or whatever it's supposed to be. But this stuff smells really good. And uh, I highly recommend it. I don't know what this is trying to be or nothing like that. But it smells so good, I'm going to just spray it. It's called in Engrave. It's good. It's a good smell. If y'all see this, highly recommend you get it, you guys. Uh, you, you women pick it up for your boyfriends or your husband. It's a good scent right here. Once again, it's called Engrave. As you can see, I won. It's about gone. I'm trying to hold on to this because uh, in a dollar store, I really ain't I ain't seen this no more <laughs> in there. So I'm trying to hold on to that little bit until I see it again. You know what I mean? <laughs> it's such a great scent. I highly recommend it now. For women and men, y'all go pick this up. Guys, you see it, grab it for yourself. Women, Y'all see it, grab it for your husband or your boyfriend or your brother or cousin. It smell that good, all right? Engrave. We moving on to the next is, I pointed on this one the other day. It's called a suit. This is another one. I don't, I don't know what it's trying to be or nothing like that. But it's a good scent. Uh... I could tell you what it's trying to be. I smelt it. There's something similar to this before, but I can't put my finger on exactly what you know what it's trying to be. But it's called a suit, right there. About to catch a whiff of what it's trying to be. That's what I'm trying to do now. Let's see. I tell you what it really smells like though. I got a whiff right then. Um uh, it's got a tobacco scent. It kind of smells like uh it kind of smells like Amen. I think this could be what it could be trying to be, a suit. I think it might be a knockoff version. It smells like Amen. Um, it smells kind of like uh, Angel Man. That's what I'm getting from this. It smells like Angel Man by Thierry Mugler. It's a good scent. I highly recommend it, guys. It's called a suit. Um, I think it's Trying to be Amen. It's a knockoff version of Amen by Therry Mugler. This is what I'm getting. It's kind of like a, a tobacco, tarry smell. Like a. Yeah, it's got like a kind of tobacco, tarry type smell. It's a good scent. Like again, like I said, I think it's trying to be Angel Man. I highly recommend it, guys. It smells that good. Everything a dollar store, all these cents can be had for ten bucks. You won't be disappointed. Once again, made by European American designers. Highly recommend these cents. Alright, moving on to the next. It's another one. If you guys excuse me now. I knocked over something. I don't know. But anyway, if y'all guys like one million by Pocket Rabon, go for Prime. Gold. Uh, this here is a good scent, great longevity, good projection. Uh, as you can see, I use half of this. Good spray on this also. I think I took this. This I took the cap up and put it on another baller uh, that that wouldn't have spray. So uh, matter of fact, here you go right here. I show you that it works. I never had no trouble on these sprayers. See here.
Something happened. For some reason, it ain't spraying, but uh, eventually it'll start spraying, I guess. Well, anyway, yeah, I highly recommend this. It's Prime Gold. Good scent, great longevity. I mean, good projection, good longevity. And um, only for a dollar, <laughs> you can't go wrong. You can't go wrong for that. I'm trying to make it work, see you. Ah, well, something wrong with it. But anyway, only a dollar. Just right here, next one up is Sultry. Uh, this is a knockoff version of John Paul Gaultier. Lamar, I'm going to spray this. Good sprayer. Good sprayer. And it smells just like John Paul Gaultier, Lamar. Uh, whew, strong. Great projection. Great longevity. Um, you know, like I said, all these scents are some really good scents. Uh, guys, you're in the store with your girlfriend and... <laughs> I highly recommend you pick up some of these scents. I guarantee y'all will come back and thank me. Uh, every time I'm in there, you know, I kind of look because they got a lot of scents for men and women. And, uh, you know, like I said, those of you don't want to spend a whole lot of money in colognes and stuff like that. I highly recommend you get these. And uh, you won't be disappointed. Like I said, great longevity, great projection. And, um, uh, just some overall good sense. And uh, this, once again, this is Sultry by the same people, European American designers. Okay. Next one up. I put test on this the other day, which is a good one. Uh, this is called Two Rings for Men, uh, made by European Sense American designers. Highly recommend. The bottle looks just like that. Uh, once again, it's called Twin Rings. Uh, a lot of times I be saying two rings. <laughs> but anyway, you see that? That's what the box looks like. It's twin rings. Uh, if I said two rings or something like that, just, I just see that and said two rings or whatever. But it's twin rings. So, if y'all are everything at Dollar Store, I highly recommend y'all pick this up because for a dollar, uh, you can't go wrong. These are some good smelling scents, man. Trust me, these things are amazing for a dollar. All right, next one up is Hot Thrills. I think this series is a knockoff version of uh, um, Ed Hardy. Ed Hardy, uh, some kind of Ed Hardy is all I know. It's called Hot Thrills. I think it's uh, Daggers and whatever you call it. Y'all know what I'm talking about. This is a knockoff version of Ed Hardy's Daggers and something. Good spray, as you can see. Let's see what it smell like. It smell good, strong though. Strong as I don't know what. Uh, really strong. Let's see. Pretty good smell. This is really strong though. Watch the sprays on this. I wore some. I always thought it was a little on the strong side. But once again, it smells so good. I just had to have it. And once again, it's hot thrills. As a knockoff version of Ed Hardy's Hearts and Daggers or something like that, I think. I'm not mistaken. Okay, moving on to the next is uh, this is Tat to 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 Ragan Nora. This here, I think it's the same problem. It's spray. I think I barred the top off of it. Okay, I'm gonna show you guys that it works. There we go. As you can see, as you can see, it's, it's working. Something wrong with that cap right there, though. Um, okay, I'm, okay. anyway, I'm going to borrow another cap from another one right here. I can get it all. All right. I'll show you guys that it works. It works good. See, good spray. I had no trouble on none of these sprays. And also, the Prime Gold works. Something is wrong with that cap right there. Okay, um... But this is it's a knockoff version of uh, Chaka Nori by Guy Larachi, like an 80s powerhouse. So if you like Guy Larachi, Chaka, Chaka Nori, this is a good version of it because it is strong as hell. I tell you, <laughs> it about to knock me out. 
right there. So, <laughs> I highly recommend it, guys. You like those powerhouse type scents? Go for this. It's Taragon Nora. It's a knockoff version of Jakar Nori by Galarachi. All right, check the spray one more time. Good spray. Must take the cap back off that. Must stick it on that prime gold. Let y'all guys know that works. Uh, oh, none of these cologne. I had no problem on the sprayers. Um, all of them had pretty good sprayers for a dollar. Uh, except those one. Don't like. <laughs> except this one. But I got uh, more of it, you know, of this. But anyway, I can prize it up and put it in a spray bottle. But for a dollar, you can't go wrong. Once again, it's prime gold right here. Then the spray, I want to act funny on. So, uh, you know, like I said, guys, if you, all you guys just want something cheap to throw on, uh, good, all these scents, it's great longevity, great projection. Um, ladies will love them. Uh, trust me, your wives, your girlfriends, or whatever, friends. Uh, you won't be disappointed about these scents because they're amazing. Uh, they're pretty classy looking baller. And uh, I'll be back. I got a couple more I want to review. And, uh, you know, I highly recommend y'all get out there and get them. Okay, once again, it's Blue Miss. EC. That's a knockoff version of uh, CK1. That's Cool Water. That's Polo Red. And Gray. I don't know what that's trying to be. I think this is Derek Mugler. Amen. This is like one million. This is John Paul Gortier. Lamar. Sautry. Ah, uh, that don't exactly know what it's trying to be. This is Ed Hardest Love, Ed Hardest Villain Daggers, or something like that. And this Jakar Nori. And like I said, all these cents, only a dollar. At the Dollar Tree, uh, I bring it's the kind of stuff I bring to y'all. I, I, you know, everybody I bet it go and get them, you know, and uh, women and men. I ain't gonna bring you nothing called fifty, sixty dollar bottle and all that kind of mess because it's nonsense because uh you know you know everybody ain't got sixty dollars blue in them cologne, you know what I'm saying? So uh I'm gonna bring you scents like this. I bring you oils, you know. I got some thirty, forty dollar colognes too. And you yeah, ain't no better than these, Harley. I don't even wear them, you know what I'm saying? So uh hope y'all enjoyed this review. Y'all get out there to the Dollar Tree. Grab up the uh, affordable scents, I'm going to say, because uh, they're really good. Like I said, great longevity, great projection, and I guarantee you guys, y'all enjoy them. Get out there. Trust me. You won't go wrong. Your girlfriend will like it. Your wife will like them. And if it don't last no more than an hour, two, three hours, respray. You know, you only got a dollar in each bottle. So, till next time, don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe, and I got another review coming up next. Stay tuned. Peace out. And go get them scents now. <laughs> Don't that look, guys. I'm serious. Go get these scents and then comment back to me and say, man, they smell, they smell good, man. Go get these scents. I highly recommend all of them. All right? Peace out, guys.